This is the CBS Evening News with Scott Pelley. A lot of us consider high school and college to be the best years of our lives. So we were surprised that a new survey finds that high school seniors aren't having the fun their parents did. Ben Tracy tells us why. I would say we're a pretty stressed out generation. Ryan Stibor is 18, a senior in high school in Simi Valley, California. She's in the drama club and taking six advanced placement classes. She's applied to eight colleges. It's a lot harder and everyone's, it's kind of becomes very cutthroat a little bit in high school of people, everyone's competing for the one spot in all these different schools, the one scholarship. That pressure to get into a good college has taken a toll on students' social lives. UCLA's annual survey of college freshmen found that just 18% of students spend 16 hours or more with their friends each week during their senior year of high school. That's compared to 38% of students in 1987. Kevin Egan is the lead researcher. He says the so-called senior slump has become the senior sprint. How different is life for a high school senior these days than it was back in 1987? You're seeing students take on more AP and honors courses. They're taking on more extracurricular activities to build that college resume, to pad that application. And so those pressures are taken away from students' time to be kids. They are also drinking less. In 1987, 35% of high school seniors spent six or more hours each week partying. That's dropped to just 9%. And those who drink wine or hard liquor plummeted from 68% in 1987 to 39% last year. Danny McLaney says he wasn't a partier, there just wasn't time. That was my number one priority in high school. Just get through it, get good grades, get accepted into college. Less drinking, less partying probably sounds pretty good to parents, but Scott, researchers say that all work and no play may be why so many college students are showing up on campus with higher levels of stress and depression. Not all bad, though. Thanks very much, Ben.